I wish I had someone I could call. Locked! That must be why they call them lockers. All right, class. Today is your final voting exam. On each of your desks is a blank sheet of paper. Please write a 100-word essay describing what you learned in voting school. Also, be sure to use pencils only. Hi, Mrs. Puff. SpongeBob, I've already given the instructions for the test. Now please take your seat and start writing your essay. Mrs. Puff, isn't it a little early for us to be taking the final exam? I mean, the school year only started yesterday. Don't be silly, SpongeBob. I'm confident in the boating skills of this class. Besides, the faster you graduate, the faster I can go on vacation. <laughs> can I have a pencil for the test? I must have left mine at home. <sighs> I miss the good old days. Children used to revere their teachers. They would give them juicy apples to show their love and appreciation. And in return, the teacher would give them a nice new pencil. Oh. Oh. Hey, Morty. How's it going, man? Not good. I keep forgetting the combination of my locker, so I wrote it down. But now I've lost the paper. No, I can't get my favorite crackers out of my locker for lunch. Oh, sorry to hear that, pal. Where's the combination? If I knew the answer to that question, I wouldn't have a problem. Last time I knew I had it, I was in the play yard. But I was in a rush to get to class. I must have lost it out there. Can I cheer you up? I don't think so. I'm so bored right now. I wish I had something fun to do. I have something fun you can do. Oh, yeah? Like what? Want to be in a TV show starring Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy? You bet I would. Mermaid Man is so awesome. <laughs> hey, I just got to finish this test and then I'm on my way to the set. Strange, I didn't see this a minute ago. This combination should work. Now I can visit Teddy. Ah, that apple is up way too high for me to reach it. No thanks, I've already had enough exercise today. So that's 
where Tentacle Acres is. Hey, Sandy! Sorry, SpongeBob, no time to talk right now! I'm frazzled more than a lightning bug in a thunderstorm! I'm craving some chocolate-covered nuts and I want them now! Sandy, you uh, don't seem like yourself right now. I reckon you're right. I never thought my cravings would get this bad, but I guess every girl has got her weakness. How can I help? Well, if you could find me some chocolate-covered nuts, then I reckon I'd be just fine. Did you find any chocolate-covered nuts yet? I need them worse than a flower needs water! I'll bet this thing gets great reception. Watch your wisecracks about my furniture, SpongeBob, or you're gonna find yourself strung up by your britches. Hello there, little guy. You look hungry. Are you hungry? Huh? Are you hungry because Sandy and her chocolate-deprived craze forgot to feed you? I'm not sure what you would eat. Would a cracker do the trick? Maybe if I feed you, you'll transform into a beautiful butterfly and fly up to the tree and knock down one of those apples for me. That's a bit of a stretch, isn't it? Eat up, little guy! An apple a day is A-OK! -okay. I wonder what could be in here. SpongeBob, I'm so surprised. You really do care. You actually brought me an apple. <gasps> oh. Yeah, it was a pretty good one, too. Only rotten on one side. Oh, SpongeBob, why? Hey, Mrs. Puff. I know this probably isn't the best time, but... What do you want now, SpongeBob? Well, you're my favorite teacher, and I really want you to be in the new Adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy TV show that I'm helping to cast. If I say yes, will you leave me be? Sure! Okay, then. I'll be along as soon as I calm down. <laughs> SpongeBob, give your teacher a minute. Tools of the trade. I can use this to sharpen a new pencil. Hey, I just gotta finish this test and then I'm on my way to the set. my friend Squidward. Sorry, no kids are allowed in Tentacle Acres. <clears throat> Where happiness is just a suction cup away. Sides, the harmonious peace that our community revels in would only appear dull and boring to a child like yourself. Oh, but I really need to see my friend. Enough, here. Take this movie ticket and go cloud your mind with an endless supply of meaningless rabble. 
grown-ups sure use a lot of large words. As long as I'm at this post, there is no way you are getting in. Collected your ticket, so please enjoy the show. Hey, wake up. But, but, what's going on? Sorry I had to wake you up, but I really need something from the snack bar. Oh no, my boss is going to be so angry. I better get back to work. I wish I had something to write this number down with. Hooray! It worked! Isn't it amazing the way some companies advertise? Mr. Hammerstein? It's about time you showed up. Listen, the dirty bubble is over on the set and he's wrecking the place. Get over there, pop those bubbles, and get that mess cleaned up. Okay, uh, what are you gonna do? Haven't we been over this already, kid?
Pickles. Hooray! Barnacles, barnacles, barnacles. I hope you didn't get in any trouble. I didn't, thanks to you. I got back just in time. My boss is a real codfish, you know. Why were you sleeping in the bathroom anyway? Well, this job isn't very action-packed, if you know what I mean. It's easy to fall asleep when the most exciting thing you do all day is scrape old gum off of the countertop. Could I have a chocolate bar? For the guy who saved my scales, you bet! Since this job is letting you down, why don't you try a career as an actor? That sounds great! Too bad I have no idea how to act. No problem! Acting is the easy part. Getting cast on a show is the real trick. Okay, but who would put me in their show? I would. Consider yourself cast on the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Wow. Sleeping on the job was the smartest move I made in a long time. I better get over to the set before I fall asleep again. Ha. <laughs> Now I can visit Sandy. I always knew I could do it! Better now, Sandy. Ooh, yeah. SpongeBob, I'm sorry for acting so strange before. It's no big deal. Oh, it is to me. I owe you one, little buddy. Sandy, I'm helping to put together a cast for the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. I'd really like you to be in it. Anything for you, SpongeBob. But what makes you think I can be an actress? Are you kidding? Only a great actress can act as crazy as you did. Well, okay. Let's get this show on the road. I hope I can do some karate in the show. You can count on it. Hiya! I wish I had someone I could call. Hello? Oh my goodness! You have to come quick! What's the matter? Some crazed maniac is playing music in public! Classical or jazz? Worse, progressive rock! Oh! Oh no! Not that! I'll be there on the double! That should keep him busy long enough for me to get in. Wow, it's probably really important to know your address around here. Hey, did you ever manage to track down Mr. Progressive Rock? How did you know about that? And how did you get in here? Um... You tricked me. Sorry. I'm gonna lose my job because of you. Oh, no! Hey, 
Maybe I can help you out. Ow. I can get you a new job as an actor on the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. If I must give in to this kind of corruption to survive, then so be it. Yeah, is that a yes? Yes, you fool. Please, give me some time to collect myself. I have been looking everywhere for you. Hello, SpongeBob. You have to come back to Bikini Bottom with me right now. You have to be in the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but I wish I could. Well, let's go then. I can't. This place is so boring that I've lost my will to get up and do anything. I thought you liked it here. I did at first, but then after doing the same thing day after day, I got so bored that I actually missed being home. <gasps> you really missed me? All right, enough of the savvy stuff. You have to help me. How can you get your energy back? I could get you an energy drink. To be honest, I'd prefer a nice mug of cocoa. No problem. There has to be a coffee shop around here somewhere. Those things are everywhere. Great. And don't forget the whipped cream. I always have whipped cream in my hot cocoa, and you can only get that at Bargain Mart. Okay, then. Hang in there, buddy. With you on the job, SpongeBob, I'm sure I'll be hanging for quite a while. Remember, SpongeBob, don't forget the whipped cream. Right. I'll be back in a jiffy. Coco, please. None for me. I'm watching my figure. Welcome to Barge and Mart. Hi, where do you keep the whipped cream? What do you want it for? Huh? Huh? It's, uh, actually for a friend of mine. <laughs> sure it is, pal. It's over there in the back. This is your lucky day. They're giving away free samples. Take as much as you want. No charge. Really? Thanks! Oh, no. What's wrong? We're having a sale on sea nut butter starting at noon today. So? That's fantastic! It's fantastic for everyone except me. Have you ever seen a horde of coupon-clad housewives loading up on cheap groceries? Uh, no. Well, you're about to!
up here. seen such amazing service skills. Well, I've had some practice. Hey, now that things have calmed down around here, would you like to be in the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy? Anything will be better than this job. All right! An enthusiastic person like you will set a great example for the rest of the cast to follow. I'll be down to the set soon enough. No need for me to rush. Oh, this guy is such a go-getter. Great items at low, low prices. This must be the last bottle. It's a good thing they hid it back here in the Kelpo section. did something right for a change. Now that you're feeling better, will you be in the new adventures of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy? If you can get me out of this dump, then count me in. Uh-huh. He's back to his old self again. Ah! 